Mason will not face hmm. charges over an incident on a plane last month. Video showed the former world heavyweight champ repeatedly hitting another passenger. Hmm. This passenger was harassing, taunting, whatever you want to say, Mike Tyson, and then this happened. The San Mateo County, California DA says he decided not to charge Tyson with battery based on the circumstances surrounded the confrontation. That included oh the alleged victim's behavior right before getting punched. The DA also said both men involved asked that charges not be filed. And one of them was saying like he was such a big fan of Mike Tyson and he was just over exuberant about seeing Mike Tyson. It turned into this like you're on a plane in a confined space, like pointing at somebody that would annoy any of he us. Was pretty like there was no social distancing going on there. I wish the flight attendants could have maybe to avoid this from happening, could have flagged down. Someone said, hey, can you move my seat? Can you put mm, me up, right. you know, somewhere different? This you know, it's bothering me. Yeah, and Mike mm. Tyson, take a private plane. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's when you see part of the video, you're like, oh my gosh, what's he doing to him? But then when you see the whole thing and the guy's kind of reaction afterwards, I'm like, was he doing this just for a social video? It I like was so. it more question. I can yeah. see why they were dropped. Just Those doing it for attention, maybe to get yeah. money out of him or just it to be cool. Yes. Oh, yeah. he assaulted me. Uh, you know, mm -hmm. I can see that. Yeah. Yeah. So. We're not part of the investigation, but I can kind no, of see it. Let's start <laughs> yeah. Tom Brady started his NFL career before the iPod debuted, but he isn't uh, going anywhere anytime soon, as we know. But yesterday, Fox Sports announced the seven time Super Bowl champion will be their lead NFL analyst immediately following his playing career. Brady confirmed the post football plans on social media. He said he is excited about joining the network, but before he starts calling games, there's still, quote, a lot of unfinished business on the field. I think it'd be settling to know what you were doing next, though. I yeah, think it's but nice you, to get an offer. <laughs> you know he's also making over $300 million for on a 10-year contract. Like $375 that's, million. Yeah, dollars. That's about more than he's made in his entire playing career. Wow. The wow. question is, like, we know Tom Brady, he's got a personality, but it's a hard transition to yeah. go from that to analyst to TV. So, I mean, I hope he does well, um, yeah. but you just never know what the reaction's gonna be like. Kristen, yeah. you're doubting the GOAT. Come on, this guy <laughs> was the 199th draft pick and went from that to the greatest of all time. He can He'll conquer anything he puts <laughs> his mind on. I just think it's smart by Fox to snatch him first. Oh yeah. You know, yeah. to be the, because anybody, Tom Brady can literally sit on TV and say, goo goo ga ga, and people will sit and <laughs> listen to it because it is the goat saying goo goo gaga. Uh -huh. yeah. He'll do just fine. And uh, I'll be happy when he retires so that the Saints can have a chance at the mm -hmm. Super Bowl again. So yeah. <laughs> Push there him out, Chris. He plays for my hometown team, so I can't yeah, I can't yeah, rush yeah. anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, the device that helped Apple change the music industry is going away. Bye bye. <laughs> Apple announced yesterday it's discontinuing the iPod. Yeah. The digital music player was first introduced back on October 23, 2001. It was the first portable MP3 player that could hold up to a thousand songs. However, it eventually started to lose popularity as smartphones took over as the main source for listening to music on the go. Ladies, do you, you still have an iPod? I think we still have one in the drawer. We definitely have like the thinner the one that one. is at the iPod Touch or whatnot. Well, I know a lot of young kids will use the iPod because it's evolved into where they can do more with it than just music, but it's not a phone. Oh, yeah. So parents can get in touch with them, but it's not a phone. Thank you. I was actually looking into one for our daughter because she loves music, but I hate having like my phone over there or putting right. my phone by mm -hmm. her head while we're taking a walk. I was like, an, I, an iPod would be great because it's, you know, just less. Right. Maybe not as much like of the wireless data right there. Right. Right. I see yeah. another good one. <laughs> I think it's a good way to give your phone a break, right? If you want to listen to music and unplug it, we don't have to have the phone, yeah, doing, right. like you just said, doing everything. So well, now yeah. it's like you can put the music on yeah. the watch if you go for a walk. And You're always connected. They're still for sale. Like you can get it and then maybe add it to your collector's thing because it's going to be a collector's <laughs> item at some point. I know it will. We all had that iPod, you know, with headphones with wires. I mean, oh my yeah. God. I know. Back in yeah. the day. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mary's going to be back with us a little bit later.